my table threw up. No. Um, <laughs> I wanted to share what I'm working on and I figured I'd be honest and my craft room is still a mess so this is where I'm currently working our dining room table so I'm gonna set y'all down somehow somewhere um, yeah sure all right and I just want to share uh, what I'm working on if I can We'll see how good it all goes. And I hope everybody's doing good. Um, Work-related kind of stuff is just lots of resets. About to lose a diamond die there. Um, today was uh, dried floral. Yay, dried floral. Yay, it's done. That's all I have to say. All right, um, this is what I've been doing. I nearly, totally and completely forgot about Ruth Burr's challenge. And her challenge had no prize um, or anything like that. It was just to pick some people from your list of subscribers that you subscribe to that maybe you haven't seen a video from them in a while or um, they've been real quiet and she says what we need to do is reach out to those people and just mail a card um, to them if you've got their mailing address as a little surprise to remind them that they are thought of and missed and we would like to see more from them again and so what I did is I went on Pinterest don't we all go on Pinterest and I just picked out some cards that really just kind of spoke to me and I've, I printed them off but it's over by my computer and I'm not going to run over there. I'm just going to share the cards that I'm working on or have completed so far and if somebody that I haven't seen something from in a while um, sees a card that they think they might like, it might pop up in your mailbox. So there's the first two cards were made similar but in different colors um, this was one I saw on Pinterest and I just fell in love with it of course my die cut is different my embossing folders that I used is different the colors are different take what you see on Pinterest okay think about it like that take what you see on Pinterest don't worry about printing off a tutorial don't worry about following somebody else's step-by-step. -step. Try your best to just take the picture, print it off if you need to, and then just use what you have and create your own image. Might be the same card layout and everything, and I thank them, whoever came up with this layout. I love it. Um, but put your own twist on it so it's your card. You made this card. You took an idea and expanded it. And I think that's what I'll, most of what we do is we're expanding on experience and imagery. And so that's what I've done. So I made this one. They are blank inside simply because I want to be able to write a note inside. All right, so there's that one. And I couldn't resist doing the butterfly in the gold mirror paper. I just love how this one turned out. And um, the dots and things that I used on these cards were supposed to be um, sequins. But I know, Laura, you sent me all those lovely sequins. I could not locate them. So I used my little mind. I have one. And I just got a couple of my punches and I punched out some shapes. And I like that using the little hearts because it's like sending you love. Hello, miss you. And of course, like I said, they're empty on the inside. Now, this next one is in the drying stage and I debated whether to even share it until it's done. But um, we'll go ahead and... I'm going to kind of leave it flat because like I said it's still drying 
Doesn't this look like a 1970s came and threw up on the card? Um, <laughs> but these are all just hearts punched out with this punch. And you do a row upside down, right side up, upside down, right side up, blah, 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 like that. And then I thought, just for fun, I'd add the red glitter to the center of a couple of the orange hearts. And then, I didn't stop there. I have something else in the works. Um, I took, ooh, I'm glad that didn't fall in the, the ink. Um, they might be dry enough because they're small. I took my diamond dies, okay, and I cut out a dream and the, in red, and I went over it with the um, little uh, Studio G glitter glue just to give it a little bling. And I'm going to add that to the front of the heart card once it's dry. And I also cut out from the diamond dies words. Hang on, I'm trying not to mess up the glitter. I cut out a little create. And I will add the, both to the card, create and dream. And that, that's gonna be, go on this card right here. So again, I'm just gonna show you the two that are completed all the way, the two butterfly cards. Cause I think these just turned out absolutely beautiful. And um, it's got some of the lace-like seam binding tied in a bow and put under the butterfly to make the wings stand up. Isn't that the coolest idea? I, I don't know the girl that came up with this, or it might have been a guy, I'm not going to say. Um, the creative individual that came up with the idea of sticking a, a bow under a butterfly to give dimension, awesome idea. So anyway... Go on Pinterest, find you, you know, five or six card sketches or cards that you like, print those pictures off, make up some cards, share them with all of us, and get them mailed out to those folks you haven't heard from in a while, all right? All right, Ruth, I'm so sorry. I'm going to put a link to your original video, too, um, in my description box below because I feel horrible. I totally forgot about this, and then I heard, saw where somebody received a card from another uh, person that took on your challenge and I said wait a minute I told Ruth I was gonna do that or I told her it was a great idea and I need to follow through so that's my share for today I'm trying to come up with a project for the love summer art if you haven't heard about love summer art yet you need to get on board there is a Facebook group um, available now if you are interested in that um, you can look me up on Facebook, uh, Becky Carr McCauley. I think that's how I'm on there. And um, we'll get you onto that group, um, either that or contact um, Cinnamon, and, uh, and we'll get you going. All right. Thanks for watching and putting up with me being silly for the day. Take care, you guys. Bye.